This is the very gentle French Jura in the region of Franche-Comté, only a few kilometers from the border of Switzerland. The local wines of Arbois are very delicate and much enjoyed with the local sausage of Morteau and the fromage of Morbier and Bleu de Gex. But for me, the highlight of the region is the extraordinary quality of the fromage called Comté from the Fromagerie Marcel Petit. The 35 kilogram wheels of freshly made Comté are collected from 30 local villages to be matured in the cave of the Fort Saint Antoine. As soon as the cheese has arrived, they brand it to make sure that they know which cheese is which for the next 14 months. Master Fromager, Claude Kerry, is in charge of maturing 100,000 Comté cheeses to perfection every year. On pose des fromages sur les planches, commence une longue étape de fabrication du croutage autour du fromage. Toutes les semaines, on va retourner, brosser, saler chaque meule de comté. Au fromagerie Marcel Petit, on a une particularité, c'est que chaque meule est goûtée avant expédition. Clément est un goûteur de comté, il est un tester de comté, et il utilise ses cinq sens pour établir la qualité du cheese. This is simply one of the best cheeses I have ever tasted. And with the local wine, it is heaven. This hearty hair stew, cooked in the local wine of Arbois, is a great provincial classic. I first place a hair, cut into pieces, in a bowl, and add a sliced brown onion, a sliced medium carrot, three crushed pieces of garlic, a whole bay leaf, two cloves, three sprigs of thyme, 30 ml of brandy, and about 600 ml of local red wine of Arbois. I cover the dish and marinate overnight. The next day, I drain the hair on kitchen paper, strain the liquid into a dish, reserving the vegetables. Next, I brown the hair in a little oil and butter on both sides and season with salt and pepper. I stir in the vegetables, dust the dish with a little plain flour and stir well before adding the marinade liquid. I bring the stew to a simmer before covering with foil and a lid. This dish delivers one of the most intense flavors of a meat dish in French cuisine. I bake it at 140 degrees Celsius for about two and a half hours. I transfer the cooked hair onto a dish and strain the rich sauce over the meat. I like to serve it with pasta and sprinkled with parsley. Voila my version of the famous Civet de Lièvre. Delicious. This is Le Domaine des Planons, a magnificent museum of the region of Bresse. And tomorrow we meet three-star chef Georges Blanc, who is going to tell me why the local poulet de Bresse, the chicken of the region, is so good.